The British Army is renowned for its advanced machinery and cutting-edge technology, boasting a fleet of military vehicles that rank among the best in the world. But which of these machines truly reign supreme? What are the most powerful military vehicles in the British Army? And are they really worth it? Well, today we'll find out together, exploring the top 10 most powerful military vehicles of the British Army. This video is part two, so if you missed the first one, be sure to check it out. I'll leave the link here somewhere. As always, we're focusing solely on land vehicles, saving warships and aircraft for other rankings. But before we dive in, if you enjoy content like this, make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for your support, and now, let's kick off with the first beast on our list. Number 10. Ernod W. Mack Land Rover The Ernod W. Mack is a versatile protected mobility vehicle used by the British Army, with 371 units currently in service. Developed as a rapid deployment vehicle in 1997, it was designed for reconnaissance and close fire support. Produced jointly by Land Rover and Ricardo Vehicle Engineering, the RWMMIK features a strength in chassis, roll cages, and weapon mounts, making it highly adaptable for combat situations. Typically, it's equipped with a 12.7mm heavy machine gun, a 7.62mm general purpose machine gun, or occasionally the Milan anti-tank missile system. In 2006, the British Ministry of Defense upgraded some RWMIKs with Heckler and Koch automatic lightweight grenade launchers, capable of firing up to 360 grenades per minute with an effective range of 0.93 miles. Number 9. Mastiff The Mastiff is a heavily armored six-wheel drive patrol vehicle used by the British Army with 329 units currently in service. Originally produced in the United States, the Mastiff can carry eight troops and two crew members, making it ideal for road patrols and convoy missions. Now in its third variation, the vehicle has been continuously updated to meet modern battlefield demands. The Mastiff is armed with advanced weaponry, including a 7.62mm general purpose machine gun, a 12.7mm heavy machine gun, or a 40mm automatic grenade launcher. It can reach speeds of up to 56 miles per hour, balancing protection with mobility. Its wheeled design offers a less aggressive profile compared to track vehicles, providing commanders with greater flexibility in handling various threats, particularly in challenging environments like Afghanistan. Number 8. Ridgeback The Ridgeback is a 4 x 4 protected mobility vehicle used by the British Army, with 164 units currently in service. Based on the American Cougar platform, the Ridgeback is a lighter and more maneuverable alternative to the larger 6 x 6 Mastiff. Weighing in at 19.5 tons, it can reach a top speed of 55 miles per hour, making it a nimble option for operations, especially in build-up urban areas. Despite being nearly 2 meters shorter and a meter narrower than the Mastiff, the Ridgeback offers the same level of protection against mines and improvised explosive devices. This makes it an ideal vehicle for environments like Afghanistan, where mobility and protection are crucial. The Ridgeback comes in four variants, a troop carrier with a protected weapon station, a remote weapon station, a battlefield ambulance, and a command post vehicle. Number 7. M3 Amphibious Rig The M3 Amphibious Rig is an advanced amphibious bridging and fairing vehicle currently in use by the British Army, with 27 units in service. Developed by the German company Eisenwerke Kaiserslautern, now part of General Dynamics European Land Systems, the M3 was designed to help transport tanks and other heavy vehicles across water obstacles, providing vital support during military operations. The M3 is the successor to the M2, also produced by the same company. It operates on roads using its four wheels. But when it encounters water, it deploys two large aluminum pontoons for buoyancy, transforming into a self-propelled ferry or bridge. Development of the M3 began in 1982, and after a decade of refinement, the first prototypes were delivered in 1992. The vehicle entered service with both the German and British armies in 1996 and has since been adopted by other NATO and Allied forces. Number 6. Oshkosh HET 
The Oshkosh Heavy Equipment Transporter is a crucial logistics vehicle used by the British Army with 182 units currently in service. Originally developed for the U.S. Army, the Oshkosh HET is designed to transport heavy military equipment, including the formidable M1 Abrams tank, as well as armored personnel carriers, self-propelled artillery, and armored bulldozers. The British Army uses the Oshkosh-built M-10-70 tractor unit, which can be configured in either A or Zero or A1 versions, paired with a DRS Technologies M-1000 semi-trailer. This powerful combination replaced the earlier M911 tractor unit and M747 semi-trailer, offering improved performance and reliability. The HET's primary role is to transport, deploy, and recover heavy vehicles and equipment, ensuring that the British Army's most critical assets can be moved efficiently across long distances. Number 5. Terrier the Terrier is a versatile combat engineering vehicle used by the British Army with 56 units currently in service. Developed by BADE Systems Land and Armaments as a replacement for the older FV-180 combat engineer tractor, the Terrier is designed for the Royal Engineers and is both highly mobile and air transportable, capable of being deployed by C-17 Globemaster III or Airbus A400M aircraft. Weighing around 66,000 pounds, the Terrier is equipped with a clamshell front bucket and a side-mounted excavator arm, allowing it to perform essential tasks such as earth moving, obstacle removal, and mine clearance. The vehicle boasts advanced mine protection and can be remotely operated from up to 3,300 feet, making it ideal for dangerous environments. In regular operations, it carries a crew of two. The Terrier is faster and more agile than its predecessor capable of reaching speeds up to 43 miles per hour. Number 4. Crave. The Challenger Armored Repair and Recovery Vehicle is a robust armored recovery vehicle used by the British Army with 75 units currently in service. Built on the hull of the Challenger 1 main battle tank, the Crave V is designed to support and operate alongside the Challenger 2 tanks, both in the British Army and the Royal Army of Oman. This vehicle is essential for field operations, as it is one of the few capable of repairing and recovering Challenger tanks directly on the battlefield. Between 1988 and 1993, the British Army received 80 of these vehicles, while an additional four were delivered to Oman. The Krar V is equipped with the necessary tools and equipment to perform complex recovery missions, ensuring that damaged or disabled tanks can be quickly returned to service. Number 3. Mamba The Mobile Artillery Monitoring Battlefield Asset, also known as Arthur, is a counter-battery radar system used by the British Army. Originally developed by Ericsson Microwave Systems for the Norwegian and Swedish Armed Forces, Arthur is now produced by Saab AB Electronic Defense Systems. This advanced radar system is designed to detect and track enemy artillery, playing a crucial role in brigade or division-level counter-battery operations. Mamba is a mobile radar system equipped with a passive electronically scanned array in the C-band, specifically designed to locate and identify enemy artillery positions. Initially mounted on the Banvan 206 vehicle, the radar is now more commonly installed on trucks equipped with ISO fasteners for greater flexibility and mobility. Number 2. TPZ Fuchs the TPS Fuchs, short for Transport Panzer Fuchs, is a versatile chemical, biological, radiological, and nuclear reconnaissance vehicle originally developed by Daimler-Benz and now produced by Rheinmetall MN Military Vehicles. This German armored personnel carrier was the second wheeled vehicle to enter service with the West German military and is known for its adaptability in various roles. In the British Army, the TPS Fuchs is used primarily for CBRN reconnaissance but it also serves in roles such as troop and engineer transport, bomb disposal, and electronic warfare. The Fuchs 1, the original model, saw substantial production with one of 236 units built, mostly for the German Army. The more advanced Fuchs 2, introduced in 2001, features improved capabilities and is still in production today. Number 1. Challenger 2 The Challenger 2 is a highly effective main battle tank used by the British Army with 33 units also adapted as armored vehicle launch bridges. 
Designed by Vickers Defense Systems, now part of BAE Systems, the Challenger 2 entered service in 1994, replacing the Challenger 1. This tank has proven its combat capability and operations in Bosnia, in Herzegovina, Kosovo, and Iraq, maintaining an impressive record with no losses to enemy fire. The Challenger 2 is equipped to engage and destroy other tanks and is operated by four British armored regiments, the Queen's Royal Hussars, the King's Royal Hussars, the Royal Tank Regiment, and the Royal Wessex Yeomanry, which is a reserve regiment. Each regiment typically operates 56 Challenger 2 tanks, along with additional supporting vehicles for reconnaissance and ammunition supply. And there you have it, folks. These were some of the best military vehicles in the British Army. Which one impressed you the most? Let us know in the comment below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the bell button to stay updated with our latest contents. Thanks for watching, and until next time, Stay safe and always stay curious.